My name is Matt McClure and I'm hosting the Dare to Inspire Riverwalk Festival on Sunday, September 10th in Waterford by the uh, Riverwalk behind Buffalo Wild Wings and Boston Market. It's a new area that we're trying to brand as the hub, the Highland Underpass and Boardwalk. Uh, it's a free festival for all. We have many activities, three different stages. We have uh, free kayak rides, we have food, and we have vendors. The Dare to Inspire Festival is uh, donated as a citizens project uh, by the Dare to Inspire Community Arts Incorporated 5013C. It was a project that started um, based on uh, a Riverwalk mural project that um, there was a termination point at the Riverwalk that never got finished from Waterford in the mid 90s. And uh, one of our members of our board, which is now a nonprofit board, um, had seen a lot of blight, as you see in the background. Um, we, had, we do murals now that eliminate the blight underneath uh, an underpass on uh, M59, uh, four blocks west of Crescent Lake. And uh, we originally had just started the program as uh, a mural renova renovation for blight. And beyond that, I, I had gone down to the property to see uh, for a press release to write up on the, on the mural project and noticed that there was a river walk that was incomplete uh, along with a pavilion and wondered why it, after 39 years that I didn't know that there was a river walk in Waterford like many other people and once we had approached the township in MDOT um, they had uh, had a contract with us to maintain a new mural project uh, for three years and uh, we had decided based on the property that we, that we had run at a festival on very short notice and uh, after the first year we were invited back by Sue Camilleri and so our festival has grown each year and uh, this will be our fourth annual and uh, still involved with the township and this year we'll have uh, Willie the Wombat from from the schools uh, come out and um, lots of minstrels we have three stages 22 bands are playing this year we're very excited about that uh, professional stage from the county and uh, professional sound and food and it's free for all, and uh, all, most of the activities are free uh, as well. So bring out the kids and come see Willie Wombat and check out the bands and eat some food. And uh, so Sunday, September uh, 10th uh, from 9 will be the vendors and 10 o'clock for entertainment, and we'll run till 9 p.m. at night. Yeah, this year, too, we'd like to uh, thank some of the sponsors. I hope I'm not leaving anybody out. Um, we have Tributesville sponsoring uh, our second stage. We have uh, Drayton Station sponsoring the main big hydraulic stage. We have uh, Tint Squad that's uh, sponsoring our acoustic stage in the main art center. And uh, we have uh, Darren over at Peace Fest and uh, many other uh, uh, local uh, individuals that have contributed. This is a, uh, a non-grant funded project. It is uh, funded by citizens at this, this point, but we uh, expect that our nonprofit will have funding for it next year. So we hope to see y'all out. Come everyone, come all down by the riverside on a Sunday, September 10th, 9 to 10.